All right, guys, so this is about installing CPU miners or any mining software. Uh, I just had the darndest thing uh, occur. I thought I had it all set up correctly, but I noticed all my miners had right here. Press any key to continue. Basically, what happened is something updated, I think, or the virus software on Windows kicked in. Strangely enough, I don't know why all of a sudden on all of my CPU rigs, it kicked in on uh, January 15th, 2022 at midnight, and it flagged all the xmrig.exes as a threat, and it quarantined them. And I'm like, what? You know, I'm just like, it was all fine until midnight, and something kicked in, and I've done no updates. I've done no updates to the Windows or restarted it. And you'll notice on this CPU rig, on this GPU CPU rig, I'm mining both, the T-Rex is fine. It didn't flag T-Rex, but it hated XM rig. So if you may see this, go check your uh, CPU miners and see if they're still up and running. This is, this is just, wow, I'm glad I checked. I said, what's going on here? Why am I getting all this stuff? And uh, I noticed I was still getting payouts uh, in the early morning and then just things just stopped. So I thought it was very interesting. So you'll see this. So what I do now, I don't know. I just go in here press any key to continue it'll kill it and if I go to my XM rig folder installation you'll see it's gone they pretty much took took the exe without my permission without my permission Windows Microsoft whatever you are and they quarantined it so what do you do all right you can reinstall it but I tried to reinstall it just for grins and it still fly the exe as oh I'm gonna quarantine this thing and it's hazardous or something all right Stop it, guys. Stop it. Okay, like I said, you'll see if you are running your XM rig. It hasn't hit any other mining software that I'm running. Like right here, I am running T-Rex and it, uh, or NB Miner too. So on my other rig, I had T-Rex. It did not affect or stop or quarantine T-Rex Miner or NB Miner. But it doesn't like XM rig. So I'll just go, like I said, I'll go in here, close this out. I'll go to my XMRIG folder. You'll notice the XMRIG EXE is gone. They quarantined it. They, Microsoft, whoever. It's just weird to hit all my rigs at once. So let's just go in here and I'll type in virus. Virus and threat protection. And I don't know why the window is so small. Okay. Uh, you can go through and you, there are a couple ways to get to this. Just, you can say protection history. And you can see, oh, not that one, not that one here. So 116 at, oh, it's 6.56 a.m. This one hit. Uh, threat quarantine. You can say it's severe. Go into your little approval. And you'll see exactly what they did. They quarantined it. Uh, they're in a restricted area. They think it XMA will harm my device. All right, good, whatever. Uh, here's the file. Verify the file. This is where my file is, xmrig.exe. Good, good, good. I'm going to say, you know what? Action, restore. Okay. Restored it. Close this out, and you'll notice it's back. Right here, it's back. Kablamo. Right click, properties, compatibility, check. Run this program as administrator. Apply. And okay. Okay, so we have XM rig restored. It should not whack it again, but now you know if it does quarantine again, you can just go in and say allow it, and you should be good to go. Like I said, it's only done it for XM rig, and it was running, so I don't know if that matters, but it didn't flag or quarantine a uh, CPU miner or any other versions of XM rig. So maybe it detected it was running and all of a sudden today on the 16th, Windows said, let's just go and run a schedule sweep of the system. I don't know. All right, so there you go. If you see this, you know, double check if you're using XM rig. That Windows hasn't magically quarantined it. And if it did, and if it did, here's how you get around it. Uh, just to allow access, you know, allow the uh, questionable EXE to run. 
So I'm just gonna run it, kick off Supernova again, run as admin. Yes. And we're back up and running. Yeah, that's odd. You, this is this whole thing about maintenance and uh, of your rigs from GPU to getting uh, crashes to um, CPUs, minor or any software being flagged by Windows and quarantine. I don't know if it does it on Hive OS or not. I have no idea. I don't use Hive OS because I'm cheap and I don't like paying fees. And I probably should have set up the uh, virus stuff on that exe accordingly when I installed it. There's probably something in the readme's that I didn't read. But there you go. So hope this helps someone. Not a big deal, but a big deal. And just be aware of it. Okay, I'm out. Thanks for watching, and I will talk to you guys later.